it's easy. It's Notre Dame and what you just asked about the players. I mean, uh, obviously, uh, it's the like best university I've ever been a part of. And uh, we have tremendous leadership from the top, uh, Father Jenkins and Jack Swerber and Marcus Freeman. Uh, he's a, a guy that's really a joy for all of us to work for. Well, fundamental improvement every day is the most important thing. That we come to the field with a understanding of what we need to do to get better, and then we work as hard as we possibly can to improve on those fundamentals. And that's number one. Number two, we're always conscious of being able to execute. We have to execute the plays call versus different defenses, and that's a, that's a second challenge. And the third thing is our effort. Making sure we're practicing hard, playing hard, working to finish blocks. Uh, just like Coach, I know Coach has probably said and talked to Tommy. It's just it's a matter of you find your best five guys. And that's what the team needed. Well, you'd like to establish a, a starting at some point. There's a starting unit got established and through the spring practice and uh, our evaluation of spring. This, this, these are the. The, the five guys that we feel like give us our best opportunity to have success. And then everybody else is, is competing to play, learning how to play. Some play multiple positions, some play one. Some of them, that's a, something that they can, you know, they're confident doing. Other guys need to stay in the same spot so they can uh, have some improvement gradually. Um, other guys can handle position switches. So that's really an individual thing. We try to give guys opportunities where they can have success. They have to all be. I mean, there isn't really one that's any different than the other. Uh, there, it's, it's something that we have to improve, and every guy's responsible for that. It's part of acclimating to playing football. And it's not running gassers and doing agility drills. Now they're playing football full speed, helmets on, 100 degree heat. So um, I have no problem with what those guys did because they poured their heart and soul into playing, practicing as hard as they could. So we have no issues with that. We progress them through, we keep working hard, and they get used to dealing with the elements. Uh, it, the thing that I think they demonstrate at times the ability to do that, and uh, what we have to improve is our consistency. But we're not playing with uh, good enough consistency, either fundamentally with our techniques or with our execution. So uh, there are plays that you, you kind of like, and there's still uh, too many plays we don't like. Yeah, work in progress, uh, learning how to play, learn how to play college football for Billy. Um, Rocco's a, a perfect example we're just talking about. You'll see some tremendous things from them and then some inconsistencies. So working on building a consistency, play after play, um, is what his challenge is. But um, a lot of a lot of good there for him.